Hey everyone, thanks for tuning in and happy Friday. Yesterday I came across this browser add-on called Tabless. Now this works for both Chrome and Firefox and essentially what it does is it gives you this really beautiful new tab background when you open a new tab in your browser. But it does a little bit more than that. So this is what Tabless looks like uh, on my browser. I've got this nice photograph here and you'll notice I have a couple of pieces of information. So what's cool about this is in addition to showing beautiful photographs, you can set up some widgets to give you some handy information. So for example, uh, my tablet setup says, good afternoon, it says the time. I get a couple of quick handy links to things that I might use regularly. I have a little quick to-do list right over here and I've got the weather and this is all customizable. So for example, if I wanted to add a quick to-do, I can click on this and say uh, zero inbox. Now I've got a to-do added. And anytime I open a new tab, it brings me to my tab list page. It shows me my to-dos, it shows me my links. I can quickly check that off. So this now becomes a nice little hub to start whatever I'm doing with the internet. So let's just take a quick look at some of the widgets that we can add to this. Um, so first of all, uh, in terms of the background, um, you have a couple of different options. You can use color gradients. You can have it rotate through different GIFs. Um, I'm using um, Unsplash, which is the beautiful photos, and you can have it change um, every 15 minutes, every five minutes, every hour, um, and you can change the, you know, customize what photos go on there, which is pretty cool. In addition, we have a number of different widgets. So I've got the greeting, which is good afternoon, good morning, good night, all that kind of stuff, and we can go in there and actually personalize it if you wanted to do that. Um, you can include the time, 24 hour, 12 hour analog, all that kind of stuff. Actually, I'm gonna add the date here, that'll be useful. So you can see it added Friday, September 4th, that'll be useful. Um, you can add quick links, so I can add um, as many links as I want. So I have my Gmail inbox and I have Google Drive. I could add as many of these as I wanted to. Um, I also have the to-do set up and I can show up to five tasks at a time and I've got the weather. In addition to that, you can add some custom CSS. You can add the literature clock, which um, gives you this little uh, quote that includes the time in it. That's kind of cool. I'm actually not gonna keep that. We'll get rid of that. Um, we've got NBA scores. You can have a custom messages rotate through, different quotes. You can have a search box built into this. It's kind of like a nice, simple little dashboard of things to, to sort of get you started. Um, what's nice about this for me is I am a big Google Chrome user. I use G Suite and a lot of Google services. I also use a Chromebook when I'm not on my desktop. So most of what I'm doing is browser based. So by using tablets, uh, when I launch Chrome or I open a new tab, I've got my dashboard of any little quick to do's I might need to take care of and any other pertinent information. Plus I get to see these beautiful photos. So I've been playing with this for the last day. Um, I really like it. And what's really nice is I've kind of forgotten that I've installed it. So every time I open a new tab, I'm very pleasantly surprised with a beautiful photo and this handy little dashboard of information. I've been enjoying it. And so far the photos have all been amazing. So they're really nice and immersive. It's a little bit nicer than like the default um, Chrome or Firefox new tab page. Um, so just kind of nice. It makes the browsing experience really handy, um, you know, and it's free. So if you want to check this out, just go to tabless.io and there's a web version you can play with before you install it so you can get to know how it works. It works for Firefox and Chrome. And, and I highly recommend it. So that's all I've got for you today. I hope you found this helpful. If you use this and you like it or you don't like it, leave a comment uh, and hit that subscribe button. I release new tech tips every Monday, Wednesday, and Friday at 2 p.m. And if you have an idea for a tech tip you'd like to see me create, throw it in the comments and I'll do my best. Thanks and have a great holiday weekend. Oh, and as a reminder, I will not be releasing a tech tip on Monday because it is Labor Day. I'll probably put one out on Tuesday, but regardless, you can expect one on Wednesday. Uh, but anyway, have a great holiday weekend and I'll see you in the next tech tip.